palace now. The Grand Inquisitor is very busy. Busy? I am the Archbishop. I represent the Pope. Monseigneur, the mission of the Grand Inquisitor is sacred. His mission was never approved by the Church. I see here only... Oh, yeah. Shut up! Shut up. <laughs> Magister, the text clearly mentions the ascension of a child during the Great Plague of Justinian. I knew it. The Roman nobles isolated him from the people and worshipped him in secret. Maybe an ancestor of Hugo de Rune. Continue. They're talking about me. By freeing the country from the bite, the Grand Inquisitor will gain the adoration of the people, and with it, unprecedented political power. Archbishop Gautier's presence here says a lot. The Pope's court is worried, and so they should be. The Seven Prima Macchia? That can't be. Prima macula, on the cusp of the first threshold, oh, no. devours the lost carrier, or walks beside the one who tames it, master or slave, order or chaos. But how can we be sure? Trista Rune's research texts are all coded. I give up. I have some good news. They finally moved her to the basement. So she's going to crack. About time. Mommy.
Grand Inquisitor. The Archbishop has arrived. Perfect. Bring him in. Vitalis. Monseigneur Gautier, I trust your journey went well. Now spare me your niceties. We grow tired of your little game, Vitalis. A game, Archbishop? <laughs> Can a game change the future of the world? Listen to yourself. You have completely lost your mind. And all this is... If I may, it's important. We have the blood of Hugo de Rune. Have you tested it? Yes. Uh, alas, Monseigneur. The boy should have reached the first threshold already, but it seems something in his blood has slowed the process. The macula is still in its original state. No matter. If the books are correct, my blood and his will be bound. When he reaches the next threshold, I shall reach it with him. That's enough. You play the martyr. But allow me to tell you the truth. You are a vile heretic driven mad by power. The Pope considers you a threat. Vitalis Benevon. You are to be excommunicated. One can excommunicate a man, Archbishop. <laughs> but not a saint. Your inquisition is over. Meaning that a new era commences. One where puppets such as yourself will kneel and beg me to save them. with us. Very good. Go and see whether Beatrice de Rune has regained consciousness. He's scary, but I have to follow him. Why does she keep resisting like that? We have the same goal. We both fight the plague. Only our methods differ. The daughter is making the same error. <sighs> Nothing. What was that? At ease. At ignorance. What was that? Wait. Wh Congratulations on capturing the child. We've been after him for weeks. And then he simply turns up here asking to see his mother. Huh. <laughs> it seems he has a sense of humor. That he won't be keeping for long. I have to go and see his mother myself. What's he going to do with her?
no! Another way! Quickly! Captain, I was told that the carrier of the macula... Is that right? The child turned himself in this morning. As I was telling you, this god was devoured. But not completely. His bones were cut up and taken away by the rats. For what purpose? To incorporate them into that material we find everywhere. You mean their nests? They use our dead to build their nests. Precisely. And if we do nothing, at the rate the dead are accumulating, the nests will eventually join together to form one giant nest. It's just a matter of time. So let us pray that Vitality's conjuration ceremony will indeed take place. Where is he? I won't find Mammy without all his rats. Uh, tell me. Why can't I hear like the others? Seeing as we have to transport them. You have nothing to fear from them. Meticulous crossbreeding and a little alchemy has tempered their instincts. Not to mention a, a radical change of diet. <sighs> Good. Hey, kid. Help me. No. Help me. What's wrong with him now? Hey, no. die quietly. We're trying to work here. I'd rather he waited. Rats prefer fresh meat. Damn you. You'll all go to hell. You and your fucking rats. Save her this rest. It's going to get mommy. Your death yeah. is not an end. For your blood shall nourish a new race of angels. They shall be your children, your pride. It's horrible. her son with a knife to his throat. She'll cooperate. So Lord Nicholas go past. That the rune woman is gonna suffer, I'd say. <laughs> Serves her right. Uh, such an educated woman. She should have joined our side. Oh, no. She's way too stubborn. But no match for our torture. She must be here. At least here, your carcass can still be of value to our alchemists. Think yourself lucky. Oh, bastard. Hey, kid. What the hell are you doing here? Shh. I have to find my mommy. The alchemist. Oh, goodness. You shouldn't. He's talking to mommy. For the last time, will you answer my questions? Or perhaps you are still upset about what happened to your husband? Right. Our torturer will take care of you. You'll soon have your voice back. Mark my words. Oh no, he's coming. Mummy? Uh-uh. Mummy? Hugo? But 
But... So they... Amicia said you were dead, but you're not. Amicia... My darling... You must go... If they find you here. No, I'm staying with you. Oh, Hugo. Did they take your blood? Oh my god. All right, Hugo. We'll go together. But you have to find the keys. They must keep them in the room at the end of the corridor. Can you make it there? Off you go then. Go.